Hi friends, uh, welcome to TechLeck video tutorials. Uh, this session I am going to explain about difference between where class and having class in SQL. Like most of the people will have a common uh, uh, query on related to uh, group by class and having class. Uh, when uh, when you are attending interviews also like uh, you will be getting most, uh, most of the questions related to group by and uh, having classes actually. So why we are going for a having class and what are the difference between where class and having class. So if you look at this example, I have an employee table, I have some data, uh, it's a sample table. Then if you want to filter some uh, data, if you want to filter some data from database, okay, that time we will go for where class. So where class is mainly for filtering data, okay. Then when you are using any aggregated columns, okay, when you are using any aggregated columns, that is uh, group, group functions if you are using that uh, minimum, maximum, average. So that time we will be using a group by class. Okay, that time we will be using group by class. And if you have specified any non-aggregated columns here, then when we will go for having class. When we will go for having class. If you want to filter aggregated data, if you want to filter some aggregated data, that time we have to go for having class. Why? Because all group functions, group functions will be using only having class. It won't be allowed in where class. It won't be allowed in where class. For example, I want to filter where average salary select star from EMP having or you can if you use where class average salary more than thousand. Okay. See here. Group functions not allowed here. So when you are using a where class, group functions group functions won't be allowed in where class. So that time we'll be using only having. So if you use having here, see here, again it will throw error. Not a single group group function. When you are using having class, you should use group by class. Okay. Always the relationship with having is group by when you are using having you should use group by class when you are using having we should use group by class like this you can see this example i want to average salary more than 2000 and specific to department wise specific to department wise you can see here if i uh, remove less than uh, like uh, more than 1000 you can see here i'm getting 30 employee number also okay like this. So when you are having a requirement to filter the group related data, filter the group related data. Normally where class will filter the data before grouping. Where class will filter the data before grouping. But if you want to filter the data after grouping, that time we will go for having class. That time we will go for having class. So this is the major difference you can find. Where class will be going for normal filter that filtering the data normal filter like fetching the data from database and that data will be filtering like based on your condition and having class that filters will be using after fetching then after grouping there is a two activities uh, will be happening in having class so first it will fetch the data then it will do the grouping then after that it will filter the data that is called having class so that is the reason Having class, if you are using, you should use a group by. Why? Because we want we want to use group by. Why? Because before grouping, you can't use having class. So that having filter will be done after grouping only. The having filter will be done after grouping only. So that is the reason when you are using having class, you should use group by. That's the reason. If you are not using group by, filter error. That is not a single group group function. Okay, so if you are using uh, aggregated functions in where class, it will throw error. Why? Because where class will filter the data while fetching from database, but having class will filter the data after grouping. After grouping, so that is the differences you can find where class and having class. Where class and having class. So if you have a requirement to filter the grouping data, go for having. If you have a requirement, if you don't want to grouping the data, directly fetch the data from database and you want to filter the data. So that time you can go for where class. 
okay so remember that when you are using a having class you should use a group by why if you want to use a group by means it is a process why because having can be applied after grouping only having can be applied after grouping the data okay so that's the reason we have to use a group by class that is a grouping the data then after grouping it will filter the data so this is the way we can go for using group by class having class and where class so thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my channel to get more videos and updates my channel thank you very much